Great here. Welcome back to Factorio. Look at all this glorious iron. Oh, I would have been in deep trouble if I didn't go out to get that iron when I did. So today, let's get engines, which require iron gears, pipes, and iron plates, and tanks, which require iron plate and steel plate. Well, I just happen to have iron, iron gears, and, well, stuff right here. I wonder if I can kind of squirrel it in here. I'm hoping I can. I probably can. And because of this, let's get these out into the network. I don't want to have to place those. If I ever need to place them manually, I'll build them at that time. Our iron production, or our steel production still sucks monkey nuts. These are stack filter inserters. Yeah, I don't need those. Okay. There's the first okay of the video. Grrr. Let's start off with the engines. I keep losing them. There they are. Iron gear wheel, pipe, and... Pipe and iron is right here. So what I can do... Yes, I'm going to make this super squirrely. Is... Oh, I'm out of splitters. Give me splitters. Gun turret damage is complete. Do I have another gun turret damage? That doesn't require purple. Nope, they all require purple. Bullet damage would be good. Bullet shooting speed would be good. Let's squeak this underneath. And now put these... All the way over here. And we need an assembly machine, of which I have none. Right. Of course I'm standing on the spot, as always. So, let's make more fast inserters. And one long-handed inserter. You, sir, build engines. You will output this way. You know what I'm going to do? Oh. Well, first things first. This is going to be a provider chest. And we're only ever going to want, say, four stacks of these. And I was going to do something about this this little handoff game that, there were, that they're doing here. Well, I'm going to do something. This clearly does not need a fast inserter because it's limited by the long-handed inserter. See? And this is one of those things where if it takes its time to build up a stock, I really don't care. I really don't. So next up, we need tanks to be automatically created. These are iron plate and steel plate. I've got steel here. Can I squirrel it in here somehow? Yes, I can. I feel like making spaghetti today. Don't you feel like making spaghetti today? I need another assembly machine. Right there. You, sir, you make tanks. And we need more power on this side. Fortunately, I got a spot right there that works. We need a fast inserter here. 
fast inserter here. And we're going to output back to the north because not a requester chest, a supplier chest. And we're only ever going to have one stack in this chest. There we go. Let's get our engine in here. So what we should be able to do now... How's the iron doing? The iron's slowing down, but we're still at max throughput here. Okay. Are we catching up on, on this side? No, we're holding about even now. Oh, wait, hold on. 50, that's 100, 200, 300, 4, 5, 6. Yeah, okay, so we're not at the 1,000 cap yet. So let's run down here. We have a whole bunch of water. How's our power? We're at 20. Why is this on a power grid on its own? Is this why I'm running out of power so much? Ah. Mistakes were made, clearly. Okay. Yes, I broke it, broke it on purpose because I, I it was right in the middle of the path, such as it is. So let's check our power again. Wow. This was doing part of the... I, I don't get it. I don't know where... Like I said, mistakes were made. I have two electric furnaces all the way over here. Interesting. Well, that's the logistics network for you. So now I should be able... I want to rotate it this way. I should be able to do this. Shift-click. Now... It's going to take out all of the wood that was brought up. Okay, there's all the engines online. And there's the tanks. Then somewhere in here, if I, if I can get through here, yeah, there's... There's the uh, pipe connectors. Nice. I like it. And I could do one more of those. So let's do that, actually. Let's just get this taken care of right now. So that works out very nicely. We're still going to be generating... We're not going to be doing anything down here. This is all going to be power. So while we're at it, let us get more... Right, I'm no longer requesting underground pipe because I have... Uh, I was using it for something else. So let's get some more solar down here. Oh, we're being attacked on the north side. Where's my solar? There it is. So... Let's just start down here. And, yeah, leave a gap so I can get to the wall if I have to. Okay, all of these engines are turned off, which means we are now storing copious amounts of water. I'll take it. Oh, 
Let me get out of there before I get trapped in. Let's get some more uh, solar on this side. There, and there. No. There. Okay. Of course, all of this is going to suck because my steel production is horrible. But let's take a look at our power array now. Oh, we're entirely on uh, on solar panels. That's nice. That is very nice. A little bit of engine power needed, so we're doing okay. I can't believe I cut this connection. I didn't realize it. I just... Bleh. Looks like they're still going up, and of course, if I have full power all the time, the bots will recharge faster, and they'll actually run faster. So that makes sense. So let's head back over here, and let's take another look at our iron engine, or iron train. Yes, I am researching something. So, okay, the robots, it looks like they, they grab the bottom first and they grab the top. So, this should be fine for the moment. Let's up our steel production because I definitely need that. And I've got coal running all over the place again. So let's come back over here. And... Grab 12 more of these. To put down in our central location. This is where I kind of enjoy modded Minecraft. Well, not kind of. I do enjoy modded Minecraft. Uh, one of the mods that I really like is uh, it makes these giant buildings that are logistics buildings, so you don't have to put all, just these fields of chests everywhere. Well, I think I have like 2,000 stored up. This is the last worker robot speed. Let's pick that up. Yeah, because I have just all of these purple science here. Yeah, my science is going to go slow because this needs... Okay, why is my green circuit production over here so slow? Electricity is at full speed. Iron. It's iron production. Yeah. Well, I know what I can do to help this along. Let's get this just max speed. Why can I not? Oh, because it's already yellow belt. I picked up the yellow belt by accident. Place the underground here. So now we're getting as much iron down here as possible. And it's still not reaching the bottom. Well, 
all of this is maxed out. If only all of this was not here. I wish I could mine that out, just get rid of it. But I can't. All those are running at full speed. I think it's time for me to get another another line of iron smelting going. Unfortunately, I don't know if this would be able to keep up. So, what's it going to take for me to get through here? First things first. Let's clean up our miners. Oh, no, no, I needed that one. Miner, miner, where's my miner? Yeah, that one, that one was still needed. That one is not. 775, 281, 659, 0, 0, yeah. God, if this could just go away. Okay. Ugh. Take a drink. I can punch a hole through here. Yeah. Uh, this is no longer in use. That's no longer in use. Let's repurpose these while I'm out here thinking about it. This one How can I do this? Well, I need to get rid of the pole. You know what? I don't care. It's all saturated anyway, so it'll run out eventually, and the other stuff will mine. There we go. So, what I can do is I can punch a hole through here and run my iron. I don't even have to come through my solar fields. I don't. Okay. Okay. So do I have a ton of walls? Yes, I do. Oh, to the south. The turrets are being damaged. In the oil area. Oh, that's not good. Well, everything looks okay. 
Ooh, slight problem. Those guns are outside of the uh, logistics network. Yeah. They're one square outside the logistics network. Oops. Look at that. Okay, two in the case of the other one. Well, in the case of this one, what I can do is put the requester chest here. And say, give me bullets. And now we're being attacked on the north side. Okay. Take a drink. Not much I can do about this one. What does it look like right now? But then again, it's, it's not that far down. I can't get through here. Okay, I don't need you anymore. This one, the logistics network. Yeah, I can do the same thing if I move this. So if we put the chest there. And 25 rounds. There we go. Get the power back up. What can I do about these guns? Well, they got 121. Well, a thousand two hundred and ten rounds, they're fine. Now they've got to overlap with the rest of the guns. So let's head back north. So if I run a line all the way across the north, I can punch through the wall at that one location. The problem is is we're getting heavy attacks from the north. Now that one's taken care of. We're getting heavy attacks, and it's probably from this base right here. Yeah, look at this. That's the problem. Can I... If I punch in through here... I don't think this is as bad of a run. I can't punch in through that wall because I have to squirrel my way through all of this junk. That is a problem. This is definitely a difficult thing. Well, the alternative is that, uh, let me get my electric, where's my electric furnace? There. Give me 50 electric furnaces, even though you only have two in the network, and it's all the way on the other side. I'm such a robot abuser. Let's take a look at this. 
That's a passive provider chest. I want a requester chest. Maybe this will work. Yeah, this doesn't tell me what the, the crafting is. I think the, there's my... Okay, let's get some power over to this. And what I want is I want some iron ore. So what happens if I put one in? It's a one-to-one -one ratio. Got it. So smelting on this side doesn't help us ferry anything over there. Except for the fact that it might make it easier for me to, instead of uh, trying to punch multiple lines through and then set up a, a smelting area, I can run, I can try to find a way to get it all the way over to here, like right in here, and then across. I don't know, I'll have to think about it. I'm going to put a cut in here. I hope you enjoyed today's video, and have fun.